Uh, the instruction department was Richard and Dino. <laughs> way it went down. I've known Richard for probably 25 years. My career started with him. He encouraged me to go back to school. I am what I am today because of Richard. His encouragement, he pushed me out there. I went back to UCLA and uh, we had wonderful times. I don't have a script. I don't need a script. Richard's in my heart. He'll always be there. You could say without a doubt, Richard was a working man's friend. If you needed help, Richard was there for you. It was as simple as that. I love Richard like a brother. I don't have any brothers, and if I had a brother, I would claim him as a brother. The times and the things we did, oh, the laughter. Oh, I can only tell you. We had some fun. We traveled the United States together. We worked together for the U.S. Department of Transportation. We went back to Detroit. We went all over the United States. And we had fun. We just simply have fun. I don't ever remember Richard being sad and down front. You know, sit, pissed off, want to fight somebody? That was Richard. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't sad. He never uh, moaned and groaned about anything. He was a workaholic. <laughs> this generation will never match his rivalry for work ethic. He had a work ethic. He had a job to do. He did his job. And he did it with great zeal. He was a good friend of mine. I always loved him. I lifted him up for prayer for probably 20 years at the time that I've known him. And about a month before he died, somebody from Division 5 sent, came down here with their pastor, and he said the sinner's prayer and accepted the Lord. Amen. I know that's true because I went to visit him. He shared with me that uh, he accepted the Lord. I said, well, that's fantastic. He said, it's about time, isn't it? I said, yeah. <laughs> I don't think... In the state that he was in, he would have been happy living the rest of his life in a wheelchair or uh, the struggle coming back. That's not the Richard we all know and love. The Richard we all know and love was an active person from bike riding to boxing and whatever it might have been. He would have loved it out there. But to live a life like that, I think God knew him. I think the Lord said, you know what? I've got something up here for you. I'll see Richard again. I don't need to cry. I will see Richard again. I'll be with them while I have fun up there. I don't know if they have coaches in heaven. I'm working on something up there. I'll have a good time. To my friend Richard, I love him. God bless. Amen.